Meep, meep. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy John Q, day two with the Roadrunner Tronic. And uh, last night I had an opportunity to kind of put a few mods on it. Just my mud guards. And then I got these uh nice little these nice little brake light, tail lights, whatever you want to call them. And uh that's pretty much it. I got my little I got my little motorcycle cushion seat put on there because that that seat on the road runner is not ass friendly. <laughs> and I do mean that literally. And uh and I figured I'll I take a peek at the VSEC app, app today and see how it works. Oh, and uh, I got me some front and back DIY turn signals. And they're wireless. I took my scene, I took my vest. I had a vest, a two-way turn signal vest, and I just cut I just cut one of them off. I just cut uh, I cut the strings off of it. And I turned it into a front and back turn signal. You know, I got it jerry-rigged on there some kind of way. I mean, it's just a temporary solution because I don't really feel all that well. And and then here in this bright sunlight, I don't see, I don't see, they don't look like they're very, very uh, visible. But, uh, and then I got these little cheap tail lights on here. Anything to improve my visibility. And I'm trying to move them together, and I think I'll put them on the blanking strobe. Yeah, I think I'll put them on the blanking strobe. Yep, and my little turn signal thingies, they work just nice. Let me see here. Left. Left. It's barely visible. <laughs> Already look like I got too much on this thing. F. And forward. And hopefully, I'll be able to see my... Um... Oh yeah, and I put these mirrors on here too. Don't know how effective they're going to be, but... I figured I figured why not give them a try so I won't be looking over my shoulder so much all right I'm gonna do my best to see if I can record the pickup of my speed not doing a speed test so I'll get it twisted As I make this little short run to the store, just wanted to see what the possibilities were for this. I don't know if, this, if I make the screen brighter, will it, will it be better? So let's see. Well, we're about to see. I'm gonna take this trip. Oh my goodness, this seat feels so much better. This seat feels so much better. Oh my goodness. I'm really not really like I'm hard. Like I'm riding a Tesla or something. Whoa. She's skidding tires. Okay, looks like we're about to get on the road. Hopefully, I can record my speed.
Okay, my speedometer showed that the fastest I was able to go on that run was 35 miles per hour. Uh, I don't know what the hell is going on because it felt like I was riding faster than 35. And so, so I'm gonna readdress. I'm gonna put on a speedometer when I come back this time. Okay. So the vest app says that the fastest I was going on that run was 35 miles per hour. So now I'm going to open my speed view app and see what it tells me. But that was weird because it's, it seems like I was going way faster than 35 miles per hour. He tells me bit more like what it feels like I'm riding There you have it. I got up to 50 miles per hour. And that's with my settings not maxed out. So I think that's pretty good. 50 is a good number for me, but I would love 55 to be the max. Not really, not really wanna, don't really wanna go to 60 miles per hour on this, uh, on this small bike. Don't really want to go 60 mile power on this small bike, but uh, at least 55 would be a perfect spot for me. So with that, that concludes my short ride for today. Uh, just another peek at my DIY mod setup. <laughs> I don't know how visible it was. Maybe I'll take her out and uh, 
and do a stand-up video to see to see how it all works out but keeping it simple keeping it simple trying to you know trying to do stuff that doesn't include me adding a whole lot of wires and this is your boy John and I'm out meep, meep.